I think we found the ideal card and said, you did a great job. And he did a fantastic job at Dixborough. Uh, one of the things that uh, will impress many of us here tonight was John's commitment night to have services at 8 o'clock in the morning, 9.30, 11, but then to come back in the evening and feature his Sunday evening movies. And during the long winter, John is an expert in movies. I mean, he picks titles just like the songs that no one had ever heard of. <laughs> <laughs> we saw movies that we had never heard of. And one of the unique things about John, he would take, and no matter how bad the movie would be, and I wonder, why are we showing this movie in a Christian church? And John would say, there's a Christian message in this movie. And he'd bring that message out, and we had these great discussions, and we really missed those long Sunday evenings in the winter, and having popcorn and pop, and watching John take a movie that none of us had ever seen. And after the evening was over, we talked about it all the way home. Thank you very much, John. <laughs> I'm Becky from Dixborough. And I had the pleasure of serving as the chair of the worship committee with John. And we had such great fun. Uh, trying to take the liturgy for the Lenten period and come up with some visuals. And uh, the one I remember most, and I can't remember the, the titles, I should have brought my picture of it, of the blocks of the various um, Abraham and the, the uh, up through the spirit in you, uh, which we added each week. And uh, Something about foundations. I know that was the yeah. thing. It was all about found, the foundation of faith, and it was sort of the, the Old Testament patriarchs, Abraham and Sarah and you know, Isaac. Right, and, and ending with the prevenient grace of, of John Wesley, and then the spirit within you. Um, oh, one more thing is that John was very generous. I. I taught uh, Vacation Bible School when we did the story of Jonah. And I decided that it isn't all about Jonah and the whale. There's something more important in that story. So I read the whole thing, which is very short. And there was a beautiful uh, kind of a song that Jonah sang when he was in the bottom of the ocean. And so I decided to write a piece about Jonah and the whale. John was very generous to allow it to be uh, sung during a sermon, and he tied the sermon in to it so beautifully. And I still have a copy of that, John, uh, that I put with the music. So uh, it's been a wonderful experience. And by the way, uh, those of us of Dixborough knew those songs. <laughs> <laughs>